Hello and welcome to Overtraining Day 1.0. This is a day of trying to fit a whole week's worth of workouts in three hours. Not recommended if you actually have a functioning brain. You know, overtraining is usually not the best thing to do, but since I haven't worked out this whole week because of uh, lacrosse, I decided to hit every muscle group today. So, we'll see how it goes. This workout right here is just a regular flat bench. Um, we're doing multiple sets, but it's the reps go 12, 10, 8, 6, 4, increasing the weight. I I did this one a couple times today with basically the major lifts, like did it on incline, press, and a deadlift, and all of them. This right here, I don't even know what to call it. It's the form of the lat pull down. It has two plates on there on each side. Um, you want to pull down one handle at a time to really focus in on the back. Um, and I grab it up top because I feel like it's harder to grip. So it gets that going. Also, the way that your arms stretch out, it helps a lot too. So that's what this one is. It, and it's, uh, I believe, four sets of 12 for this. Here's the incline press, same thing as the bench, uh, the flat bench, um, 12 all the way down to 4, this is, this was actually pretty light for me, so I think I wound up doing like 7, um, and I think that this is, I uh, don't know, uh, 155 or something like that, on the flat bench, I know I did 185, but... Oh, that's 175. That's what this is. This right here, I actually had to split up the video because I took a little bit of a break in between the second and last part. But there's three handles on this. I don't know if you can see that. One's wide, one's close, and one's right in the middle. And you do seven reps on each handle. Um, this right here, I have two plates on it. Excuse that guy who walked through. Um, and this actually kills really, really badly. Like, and that was the break right there. Uh, now I'm on the middle handle. This one hurts the worst. I don't know why. It just, it kills you. Um, and this was three sets, I believe. Here's decline. I did it to failure. I only got three in. I was supposed to do the four. Um... Luckily, somebody helped me get it up on the last one. This right here is the form of lat pull down again. I've been doing this one. I still don't know what to call it. Um, I know I'm controlling 140 in this video, 140 pounds. Um, yeah, but this I love recording just because it shows all the back, triceps, all that good stuff. This right here, I don't really like the form that I had. I usually can do it better, but uh, it's another chest workout going down. I also pulled the slide down so it was straight across and basically did the same thing for another 12 reps, but just straight across. And here's deadlift. I'm very proud of this one, actually. This is 315 for four. Um, same thing, the 12 all the way down to four reps. This was the last one, the four reps. Uh, happy I can actually grip and control 315 now. This right here is a little bit of shoulders, uh, 65 pounds on each side. Uh, my shoulders are still kind of weak, so I took a break in between, like a little 10 second break that cut that out. But um, yeah, you can see how that struggled right there. Um, and then I just started to take it slow, but I grouped this today with uh, chest and back going in between, and then my shoulders and legs going in between to finish it off. Uh, I did forget to do shrugs though, which I wound up doing like, the next day in a uh, weight room. This right here is just regular squats. Uh, I think I did. That, that's Seppi. 
Uh, I think I did two fifty five for four. So I'm happy that my strength is going up. I can actually hold it without feeling lightheaded. This right here, alternating standing shoulder press. Uh, it's actually a chest machine, but uh, if you turn around and you do it how I'm doing it, you pick it up and lift it like that, it doubles as a shoulder machine. So and I also took a break there too, just because my shoulders, they get tired very easily. Um, this was for 12 reps on each side, I believe. And this one, something that my trainer showed me. You stand on a plate, and you have the bar on your back, and you just do calf raises. Now this, this, it had me cramping up later. I was definitely feeling it. Um, this I actually had 275 on the bar, more than I could squat, but, uh, yeah. And then this, I still don't know what to call, I call these flying bees just because you go up with the elbows going straight up in the V formation. Um, I had 35 pounds on each side on that, it was for 12. And this is to end the video right here. Leg press was 600 pounds, it's a pretty light weight for me, uh, for 12. And I just kind of blast through it. So. That is all the workouts that I did minus like three.